told me about a dream she had one night. And again, yes, you tell each other our dreams are Gmail as well. This is when she was dating Seba, so they were together at the time, and she said, I had a dream that Serra was taking me to this city, la ciudad más romántica de todas. Y era como un desierto, and it was like a desert, with houses all along, where in each house there was a couple telling you their love story. Look at us today, sharing with you two your love story in the desert of Cabo, la ciudad más romántica de todas. This is Tierra Sagrada, or in English, Sacred Land. Hoy es un día sagrado. No solo por ser la boda de Maite Chep, but because here we are, friends and family, all joined together by this beautiful place, Terra Sagrada, celebrating their beautiful love story. Uno más uno es más grande que dos. Cuando lo sumas a la suma, el amor. The touch of a hand that shows you care. The smell of your skin, a comfort within. The smile of encouragement that helps you dare, knowing that no matter what, you'll be there. The listening with love, for love listens more. Trust and tenderness at your core. Trust and tenderness at your core. Going out in the world, so much to explore. With freedom to seek what your heart calls you for. Speaking your mind, authentic and true, with respect for each other's point of view. And the sharing of tasks that are hard to do. And in sickness, support to pull you through. The door of your home, forever inviting. The joy and the laughter, lifting, delighting, a lifetime of moments. Each one enriching the dreams that you build together. Combining. Uno más uno. Que será más grande que dos. Porque le sumarán a la suma su Your lives are a result of each of you having two parents, Felipe and Bero, for my. Jaime and Joe for Sebi. Two gra four grandparents, Tomás, Samoma, Enrique, and Cuca for my Abby, Yaya, Cynthia, and Kenneth for Sebi. Eight great grandparents, 16 great, 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 great grandparents. How many struggles, how many battles, how much happiness, how many love stories, how many miracles, how many expressions of hope for the future? that your ancestors have to undergo for you to exist in this beautiful, present moment. For a decade, they held a special place in mind for each other. Mike always referred to Seb as someone que me encanta, as Ine very well uh, described. And Seb says, I always knew she was special. I always liked her. Seb sent Mike the letters. Mike sent a soccer ball keychain to Seb. We should have compared notes, <laughs> which is now the keychain to their apartment. And so when they coincided 10 years later at Stanford, the expectation was high. I was texting my day, we were all waiting, like, so, did something happen? But once they decided to get back together, the rest is history. 
As Seb says, I never doubted I wanted to be with her then forward. And I've never seen Maite more sure about anything in her life. We identified three pillars of what is sacred to Maite and Tess. Number one, familia. Number two, creating. And number three, one another. As long as stars are above you Longer if I can 11,367 is the exact number of emails and chats that we have on Gmail to discuss what at the time seen this life-defining topics of conversation. It started in 2014, this is before Mike and Sebas were back together. Suddenly, there was one topic of conversation that was pretty recurring between the two. He's one hell of a time. Now it's me. And this time I get an email from Sebas. He was launching this campaign to raise awareness about climate change that was called We Knew. And in that campaign, he was asking people to write letters to their future children about what they had done for the fight for climate change. I, of course, forward the email to Maite, and Maite has seen it from Sarah, and she replies to me, ¿Qué tal eso? I'm in love. Then Maite, jokingly, pretends she's writing a letter. I don't know nothing about climate change. All I know is I love that. As regards, mom. You have one job on GSP. If you can leave with my nothing else. Nothing else matters. One job. Sebs, you're a great friend. You're destined for great things. It's only fitting that for as amazing a person as you are, you found an equal partner in Mike Dub, who constantly challenges you and usually wins. <laughs> This is a way of raising the bar so high and doing it so effortlessly. Music bed. That, that Time bar seems within reach. And that's really how I live my life, my being next to her. You won the most fierce, loving, building partner in the world. And I know that from experience. I first met Mike 15 years ago. She was a little girl. As you all know, Sebastian and Maite were at school together, and one evening, Blue Sebastian asked me if I could help them explain PPP. When we said PPP, I said, he's stand, kidding me. He's well, it, 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 actually, PPP in economics says the purchasing power parity. So I, I knew a little bit about that, we then came to, to the house, and then along came this fresh, bright, young girl with a lovely smile and a twinkle in her eye. As we sat in the dining room talking through the PPP, I quickly realized that she understood these concepts better than Sebastian or myself, or myself for that for that matter. She's, she's, I mean, she's something else. The magic thing with Maite is how she makes people feel about themselves. She makes people feel comfortable to open up to her. Many here have come out and opened up to Maite, telling her about their deepest struggles before anyone else trouble in a marriage or how motherhood isn't exactly what you thought it would be. And it's because Maite, when Maite loves you, she sees you without judgment. And she's so strong that she helps you see that strength within yourself. She makes you feel both held and free to be your truest self. But she is one who is able to get the best out of most people. And I think that is evident in the energy that she transmits when you interact with her. I feel truly lucky to have her now form a part of our family. And I think the best description of Maite is how Sebas described her to my parents some time ago. He described her as peace, as home. And in the end, out of all the things that I have said today, I think that is the one that only truly matters. Maite, Sebas, 
I'm so happy you have found your peace and your home in each other. I'm so excited about what you are gonna build as a couple, as a family moving forward, and know that I will always be there loving and supporting you guys. Congratulations. The house turned into a fortress and a boat as necessary. Sometimes it was a skyscraper and sometimes a beach. Tides rose and fell upon it. It emptied of children and filled with guests. It emptied of guests and filled with children. Sometimes it shrank to a porch with room for just two rocking chairs. He rocked slowly while she talked about serious things and told jokes, and then they were quiet for a while. By that time, they barely needed to speak. Even when they weren't holding hands, they were holding hands. These are the hands of your best friend. Young, strong, full of love for you. That are holding you on this wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. Gracias por ser el amor de mi vida desde siempre. Qué suerte. Prometo seguir reencontrándote siempre, todos los días. Reencontrarte en el esfuerzo, en los sueños, en lo fácil, en lo difícil, en las aventuras. Reencontrarte a través de muchas versiones de ti y muchas versiones de mí. De la familia que hagamos juntos. Saber siempre cómo reencontrarnos tú y yo en el camino. Trabajar para ser la mejor versión de mí. Dar espacio a ti para ser la mejor versión de ti. Cuidar y honrar tus sueños. Priorizarnos y que esto sea siempre sagrado. And make the most of it. And all in. Para así regresar a ese papel y escribir que me casaría con Sebastián Serra todos los días. Te amo. The way you make me feel, the love you show me, and the love I feel for you, makes me convinced that the answer to would we be here if these things and others hadn't happened is always yes. You make me feel like the universe has always, and will always, conspire to bring us together. Almost as if saying, oh, you guys missed this in high school, and then again, despite a romantic trip in Europe? No problem, have another go at grad school. And I'm sure that if we had missed each other at Stanford, we would have had another chance, and another. I've loved this thought exercise over the last few months, because its conclusion is that in every possible version of our lives, we will always end up together. Love is actually a switch. You don't choose how it turns on, who it turns on with or when, but it's your choice to let it live, to let it grow, and to never fail. You two set the bar so high, and yet make it seem so achievable. You're immovable rocks to those who you love. You're always there, and so I'm so happy that those who you love will now have a spectacular, immovable boulder to some of you love. Padre nuestro, que en los cielos estás, haz a los hombres iguales, que ninguno se avergüence de los demás, que todos al que sufre del hambre la tortura le regalen en rica mesa de manteles blancos, con blanco pan y generoso vino. Ayúdalos a sobrevolar el campo de batalla y recuérdales que despertar en el otro será siempre ver la luz que lo de afuera vino a devolverte y creías perdido. ¿Todos? Gracias. Gracias.
encanta y admiro mucho Music cuánto bed. valoran pasar tiempo juntos en familia. Siempre con balones de todo tipo, pelotas de todos los tamaños, más películas y televisión de la que he querido ver en toda mi vida. Pero juntos y presentes, que es lo único que importa. Gracias por eso, los quiero mucho y me emociona seguir pasando tiempo Music juntos bed. en la vida. Solo me queda decirte que mientras Dios me dé vida y fuerza, aquí siempre te esperaré para cuando me necesites. Pero esta vez de verdad, no como cuando te engañaba diciendo que te esperaba afuera del colegio. Y también te espero a, a ti, Chepo, si alguna vez me necesitas. Gracias. The third most important thing that Sebas taught me was the importance of family. The importance of always being there as a helping hand. He taught me the most special type of love, the unconditional one. And you have no idea how much that means. He I love you. you know, he doesn't care about the immediate, the short term. He's, he's thinking long term. He knows where he wants to be. Uh, and I think he's willing to, to make the tough decisions and, and actually do the thing that will get him to where he wants to be, which is, I think it is, to be 80 years old and look back at his life and said, I did my part. I helped. Music bed and passionately spent himself in worthy causes. Because Sebas knows that it's not the credit who counts, but rather the man who's in the ring. They, they made me feel so welcome, so taken care of, so loved, um, and they've done that ever since. They, they continue every time I come uh, and see them to make me feel like a part of the family, uh, incredibly taken care of, buying me Choco Crispies uh, so that I can have those dinners. So thank you also for that. I'm, I'm so, so lucky and I'm so excited to now formally be a part of your family. Maite and Chepo, you are my role models not only in letter composition, but in life and love. I know that many and most of us here hold your journeys as individuals and as a team in the highest regard. Sebas, I have always looked up to you and will continue to do so. You will forever be a person I strive to resemble. But today, I'm especially happy because I will not only have you, my big brother, to look up to and follow, but I'll be able to call a woman I have always looked up to, my big sister my beautiful big sister, Mike. She is truly the best sister, daughter, granddaughter, leader, boss, friend, maybe future president, the first man over there. <laughs> she works for everything super hard, but also she cares so hard. And what gives me the most confidence in her life is that now I see her that she's accompanied in that pedestal. I've never seen her as happy as she is right now. I've never seen her as happy as she's been with you. And that is pedestal worthy. So yes, love is definitely a switch. It is. And thank you both for turning it on so long ago for letting us experience that switch with you, that whatever it is that gives you all that chemistry and energy and just love, and for knowing that every day you choose, that real love is worth never turning off. I like to think that at some level, Maite and Seb and their wisdom beyond their years found each other and felt a kind of yes, but not yet. Surrendering completely for life to take its course and trusting that it would turn out as it should, as it always does. Oh, if I can help fall in Yo, Sebastián, te acepto a ti, Maite, te acepto a ti, Maite como, mi esposa. como mi esposa. Yo, Maite, Yo, Maite te acepto a ti, Sebastián, como mi esposo. May the road rise to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sunshine warm upon your face. And until we meet again, may the Lord hold you in the palm of his hand. So, by the power given to me by all of you, and none other, none other than this Tierra Sagrada, 
los pronuncio marido y mujer. I know that these three pillars, family, creating, and one another, will stay with you always and help you love and cherish each other as you continue to build an amazing life together.